Hello everyone and welcome back to Island Vibes Recipes. So a few weeks ago, we filmed and uploaded a video entitled The Green Smoothie. That smoothie makes you feel younger, makes you feel great, right? But today we are doing a new and improved version, completely revised. It's way better, it works wonderful. All right, so let's go through that video really quick. So I am making for a household of five today. So the ingredients are for five persons, two adults and three children because they really love the smoothie. So in my blender, I have added three cups of pineapple juice. Now this pineapple juice does not have any sugar in it. So it's sugar-free pineapple juice. Now this recipe is not for pregnant ladies because there's an ingredient called bromelain in pineapple juice that causes early labor in pregnant women. So caution, this is not for pregnant women. All right, so I've added to the blender three cups of unsweetened pineapple juice. And what I'm going to add, the first ingredient we're adding is lemongrass. All right, I am going to put the benefits of lemongrass for you. All right, I'm not going to talk about it right now because I want the video to be short. So I just chop up the lemongrass a little smaller. Right? And I'm adding it to the smoothie. Lemongrass is the first... Yeah, help me kids. Thank you. Thank you. Lemongrass is the first ingredient. Right? Now my blender is really powerful. So it really doesn't take long to the Italian. <laughs> right so let's blend it up and as soon as it's blended we'll be right back pineapple juice with the lemongrass next you have to strain it people you have to strain it because lemongrass is extremely stroy <laughs> it's really stroy and to drink it no it's not going to be pleasant and this is going to be a really pleasant smoothie. So I'm going to put in the description the use the benefits of lemongrass. It's really, really healthy. Really healthy. Alright. Just going to squish it in really quick. Get out all the juice. And this doesn't blend for long, people. A probably a minute until it's completely pulverized. Alright. Yeah. I want to get out all that pineapple juice. <laughs> Alright. Can I just rest this in the sink, please? There you go. Right. And now, you're going to add this mixture back to the blender. So this mixture is pineapple juice and your lemongrass. Alright. To this mixture, people, the next ingredient, I have six tablespoons of fiber three mm. tablespoons of flaxseed um, or linseed chia seeds. yes and three tablespoons of chia remember this is a recipe for five persons if you're just making for yourself it will be one tablespoon per cup of liquid right but it's for an, this is for an entire family so i'm adding all short talia i'm adding all talia one side it's come closer talia just throwing the entire thing we don't have to <laughs> And then we're just putting oil. Yeah, we're putting oil. Right? You have to be careful, honey. Right? That's good. That's enough. That's good. You have to get every bit right now. Right? So we've added. Tell I went back this spoon because you didn't put it. That's back this spoon. Right? So we've added three tablespoons of flaxseed and three tablespoons of Josiah Chia. Right? And what I do, I just start it low and then I blend it on high until it's creamy and thick. All right? So we'll be back with that. Four. All right, so we are back with the recipe, the new and improved version. So let's take a look at this consistency, people. See this? That's what you want. You want to osterize it, blend it until it's creamy and smooth. That, that takes good. about two to three minutes it doesn't take long 
right so now that i showed you this mixture to this mixture i'm now going to add again two cups short i added two cups of pineapple juice the same unsweetened juice right two cups so there we go so all together i've added five cups of liquid and to this really quick i'm gonna add this is about two inches of ginger right okay. ginger is really good <laughs> right i'm gonna add two leaves wonder of the world right i just break it up like this just say you could um break up the kale we're gonna get to that i add i add about a, a leaf of moringa a whole leaf we're not adding all of that it's just for this plate we're not adding all of that princess <laughs> right and i am going to add stinging nettle right it's about a bunch of singing nettle right put it down in there and then josiah and talia are gonna add the kale for me go ahead i'm gonna add the kale talia just break it up with your hands just break it up yeah Break it up. Don't be scared. Alright. Alright, it's a bit full. So let me blend and then we'll add that next piece. Alright, now this is organic. All these things are organic. Alright. Now, the reason why I added the chia and the flaxseed is for more fiber. Alright. Fiber is really important to remove debris and toxins and waste that becomes lodged and attached to your colon. And when when waste is attached to your colon, you get a lot of diseases, colon, cancer, and all sorts of things. So the fiber is really, really, Josiah, important to add to the smoothie. All right? Just remember, when you are using anything with a lot of fiber, you have to use a lot of water in your diet. You have to drink water. So let's say you buy a, a, a supplement that has a lot of fiber in it, like Metamucil, and you're using it, and you realize you're constipated. You're constipated because you're not drinking enough water throughout the day. So it's not that something is wrong with the metamucil, you know. It's because you are not drinking enough water. So please remember to drink your water throughout the day. One cup of water is not enough, people. All right? So let's blend this up. All right. All right, welcome back. So the smoothie is finished. The kids are anxiously waiting. You see how creamy it is? Now, if you don't want it this thick, you don't have to make it this thick. You could make it a little more runny by adding more liquid, but we like it like this because this is a this is a meal for us, right? So we'll drink this in the morning and we'll wait about an hour to eat, to have breakfast after this, right? Full of fiber full of vitamins and minerals and it gives you a lot of energy it keeps you full when you put the, when you add the chia and the flaxseed it keeps you full so that's it don't forget to like subscribe and hit the notification bell all right thanks again folks and i really hope you enjoy this recipe leave your comments tell me what you added and how i could improve this video for you guys thanks bye, bye. <laughs> okay everyone so you see how the kids love the smoothie kids do you all love the smoothie yes. you see it is a wonderful way for the children to get all their veggies because children don't really always like to sit down and eat a whole bowl of salad with lettuce and cucumbers and tomatoes right um so this is a great way to add some fiber vitamins and minerals to their growing body all right shout out to just natural products they have a wide range of fresh juices and fruits and nuts and grains all right so thanks for viewing our video don't forget to like share and hit the all right, bye guys. Bye.